I think that's a really great question. Buyer personas are a fictitional representation of your ideal customer, and that's the key, your ideal customer. So it's really the foundation of everything that you do in your sales and your marketing, really your overall business plan. I'm a strong believer that you should really be trying to target your ideal customer and not be all things to everybody. Not a really big fan, especially if you're a smaller company trying to, to grow, to be going after wedding planners, weddings, trying to do hotel work, doing parking shuttles, corporate accounts, sports teams, schools, universities, getting into motor coaches, all that type of stuff because we spread ourselves way too thin. So if we really focus and we understand that the buyer persona is your ideal customer and it's the foundation, and here's why it is. Because you need to know that, <clears throat> excuse me, that the DMCs in your market are 67% female and their average age is between 37 to 52 and they have 14 to 20 years experience and they have 2.3 kids and they're married and that their interests are, you know, in design and food and all of these different things so you can have an intimate relationship with them. Because if you do have an intimate relationship with your buyer persona, and that's just another name for your prospects that you're trying to acquire, then you can really deliver value to them. And if you can't deliver value to them, meaning you don't have any relationship, but from a targeting perspective, you can target them with stuff that they're interested in, not trying to sell your services. Once you do start to establish a relationship, now you're getting into the component to where you are doing solution-based selling, value-based selling, to where you know what their problems are. You need to know the top five problems at minimum for each one of your buyer personas. And if you know those top five problems, those top five issues, those top five pain points, and you can provide solutions to them in a solution-based selling and marketing component, you're gonna win. It's really that simple. Here's the deal. Think about a DMC. If you only know two of her problems and your competitor knows five, and you have solutions to her two problems, and they have solutions to five of her problems, and they're all equal weighted value for her, who do you think is gonna win? They are. So understand your buyer personas, do research, ask your customers, get to know them intimately, and you will win over your competition. I look forward to seeing all you guys on the next episode of the Ask Limo You Show.